enjoy anything. Imagine death is creeping up behind you, but it's all been what you manifest. Mm. Yo, it's all about what you manifest. Mm. That last bar right there, that is everything. Hey yo, what's happening? People, this is your boy Blaze here for Venomous Reactions, and today we got a little bit of music here for you. It is from one of the reaction channels I love watching, and it is from Dwayne TV, aka better known as Dwayne Jackson. It's all in your head. Now, for those that don't know who Dwayne TV is, he is a reaction channel, but he's also sick with the music too, and I love his level of wordplay. Like, for some of his music that I checked out in the past, yo, bro, bro's pretty fire. I can't even front. So, I feel like this one is not going to be any different. So, we're going to check this out here and see what this is about and see if I can break down some of these uh, Dwayne bars here. <laughs> you feel me? So, I'm going to make a good attempt. I'm going to make a good attempt. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Lately, I've been going through some shit. Mm. From worrying about loved ones, to health anxiety, Ooh. to wondering if any of this stuff that I'm putting all my heart and soul into is ever gonna actually mean anything. Mm. Right there, he's just going deep, like he's doing like a deep reflecting. I mean, I mean we all go through that period sometimes, like, you feel like your best is not enough. Like you give, you give, and you put everything into all that you do, and you feel like it's still not enough. And loved ones, you feel you feel like they don't worry about you as much as you worry about them. It it just brings everything to surface that is this is this really all worth it? So this is what I'm picking from it. Yo, I may be wrong, but this is the vibe I'm getting. Yo, I'm digging this so far. Regardless, I keep busting my ass. You got to. I keep hoping that something that I'm doing is going to reach somebody and maybe give them some inspiration. Or at the very least, help them understand that they're not the only ones going through some shit. Hmm. Because of that, I keep pushing. I've been feeling like I'm dying on the inside. I hmm. forget what living life has really been like. I'm so stuck Ooh. inside my head, I think I'm lost, but I pray to God in hopes that it's just something I can get by. Hmm. Hmm. You, you often forget how to live life, and you just pray and lean on your faith that you could just get by. Just. Just for today, only to wake up and do it all over again. See here, see here is like ref, ref, reflecting, but also coming to a realization. You, you basically sit and reflect, and you come, you come to a certain point, and you just wonder. Do I have the strength to make it through the day? Mm. Yo. Yo, so far, Dwayne TV, <laughs> you are not missing my guy. Because I can relate. Sometimes I'm really worried about what's wrong with me. Other times I think the stress is what it all could be. Hmm. My mind is like a trigger till I fall asleep. It hurts to be held hostage by the thing that gave me all my reach. And Woo. still you see I ain't escaped the pattern set. Every day I think I'm dying, but I haven't yet. Hmm. I barely enjoy anything. Imagine death is creeping up behind you, but it's all been what you manifest. Mm. Yo, it's all about what you manifest. Mm. That last bar right there. That is everything, because everything you manifest comes to light. So 
you try to manifest all the positive. It don't it just completely ignore the it yeah, completely ignore the negative. Manifest nothing but positivity. No matter what no matter what comes your way. It could be life, it could be a stressful situation, it could be just you know, your circle of people that's around you. <laughs> yo, why do I feel like he's speaking to me right now? Because, yo, yo, sometimes I get like this. And, and I try to pretty much just ignore all the negative that's going on in life and just, just focus on the positive. But when it compounds you heavily, yeah, it, 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 it's almost impossible to ignore. So he's saying just manifest a whole lot of positivity to the best of your abilities. And just just relinquish all of the negative and let God handle it. Because you can't handle the negative. You can't handle the negative by yourself. You need his help. Always. I love it. Now it's time to figure out the next stage. Am I really healthy or his death came? Mm. Change my perspective on the small shit because none of it would matter if I couldn't see the next day. Facts. So now all that little shit is menial. As long mm. as I maintain my health and I can see it through. Mm. I'm only focused on the major things in life like spending time with family and finding ways to reach the truth. Mm. I want to help the world out in some way. Sick of sitting in my room trying to complain Sick. When there's so much more that's out there in this life I gotta figure out my issues Hope I make it happen one day mm. I understand that health is most important Once it's gone, there ain't no money that can sort it mm. You can have a million dollars in the bank But that debit card is something you'll be dying on the floor with <laughs> Yo, you can have all the money in the world <laughs> But Let's be real. <laughs> when death comes a knocking, <laughs> you're not going to be able to take it with you. So all the money you have, <laughs> when that time comes, it's going to be meaningless. <laughs> and you're going to be holding that debit card to the de to the day <laughs> to the day the casket drops. Yo, be wise. Be wise of be wise of what's really important in life. Cause riches. They, they're just like, they're just basically materialistic things. Like all the riches and all the wealth in the world doesn't mean anything if you're, if you have it. It doesn't mean anything if you have it, but still miserable. Gems, I love it. I go through this battle on the regular Fighting with my demons in my head Like yo this better work hmm. I'm usually complacent and it's sad Cause it makes me think about the times I wasted in the past Ooh. I just gotta find a path through this mentally mm. I've been learning that there's nothing out there meant to be mm. It's all about the hard work and dedication If you don't make some sacrifices It'll never get in reach So I'm striving for the things mm. I wanted as a kid I spent way too many years trying to pack a hit Getting high controlled my mind in the past Because the truth is I just wasn't strong enough to actually live That's a fact. Now I'm in a whirlwind of change From the way I live and eat To the essence in my veins I've adapted mm. Now there's a presence in my ways And if I can make it through this I'm forever in the chase The chase to be a favorite Yo. Everything that you realize Once you come to that realization Yo life will begin to flourish that's basically what he's saying because once you realize your full potential yo sky's the limit at this point i mean there's basically nothing that you cannot do just keep on pressing forward keep on pursuing everything that you desire pursue everything that you're passionate about no matter how rough the road gets because <laughs> The road is going to get rough, no matter what. But do not be stuck at that difficult turn. Because once you're stuck there, it's difficult. It's difficult to get away from that difficult turn and continuing on. 
<laughs> yo, 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 Dwayne, Dwayne TV, bro. You deep, bro. I love it. I, I love deep shit like this. <laughs> it really makes you think. It really does make you think. And, and I love music like that. I love music that can really sit there and make me think about things that I've never thought about before. <laughs> The chase to reach the majors, the chase to change the world in a way nobody's made it. I'm focused on my life, and I'm confident I'll take it to the level that I've needed. So I'm promising you greatness. Mm. Promising greatness. Yo. <laughs> this is my first time checking out Dwayne TV and actually giving feedback to it. And <laughs> like I said, I love his... I love his wordplay and it really makes me sit back and think about think about pretty much everything that he was saying in that song and I managed to catch like I managed to catch like to me what stuck out to me the most and <laughs> I may have been long-winded but yo <laughs> I can't help it that's how that's how I am but I love deep lyricism I love deep lyricism that really that really makes you like take a seat, take a seat and really make you think. <laughs> Yo man. Yo, this song right here, I mean, I'm going to have to put this on my playlist. No, <laughs> no lie. <laughs> but yo man, let me know what y'all thought about this one, man. And what really stuck out to y'all the most in this one? I I'm I'm intrigued to know. So leave the comments down below, man, and support the original content. And yo, check out the Wayne's TV's uh channel, man. Yo, his channel is dope. I love his reactions. I love his level of thought process when it comes to doing reactions. Yo, <laughs> as always, thank y'all for tuning in. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. And don't forget to tell your peoples across the globe. Come kick it with your boys. It's one good solid time. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to share. And don't forget to click that bell so you don't miss a video from the kid. You feel me? And follow me on social media right over yonder. This is your boy Blaze here saying Chuck the Deuce. And I will see y'all in the next video. I'm out.